the wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Real Madrid. They face Bayern Munich and it's live. This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It's Real Madrid up against Bayern Munich. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. dissect the Real Madrid side Thibaut Courtois begins in goal Luka Modric plays with Tony Kroos in the centre of the park and rather than use a strike partnership they've gone with just the one player in attack So they starting 11 for Bayern. Jan Sommer is the goalkeeper. Dayo Upamecano plays with Matthijs de Ligt in central defence. Serge Gnabry starts with Kingsley Coman out wide. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Thomas Müller. And they get the ball rolling in the Champions League final. We're about to find out who will be crowned Club Kings of Europe. Federico Valverde. He must finish! And the keeper flings himself at the ball. Fired over by Kroos. Well, the danger is still there. Kamavinga. Now with Bellingham. Eduardo Kamavinga. Rudiger. And a good tackle. Coman, plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Corner for Bayern then. And deciding to go short with this one. Well smuggled behind for another corner. And played in by Kimmich. Well, the keeper won't be complaining about that corner kick delivery. His ball all the way. Well, a magnetic player to watch, Federico Valverde. Stuart, what part might he play in this game? Well, he's the most creative player on the field. He can run with the ball, he can get himself out of tight situations, he can see a pass, he's very creative with his play. I think he's going to be the outstanding player today. Crossing possibilities. Can he convert? And using his body to good effect. Vinicius Jr. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Musiala. And Kimmich. Goretzka. 
a really sumptuous ball and Coman's through here and they scored first goal in this season's UEFA Champions League final Well, this replay shows just how good Goretzka is when he runs with the ball. And Koeman couldn't hit this any better. What a great finish this is. So the action continues. Will there be a quick response from Real? Rudiger. Here's Carvajal. Well, the foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Vinicius Jr. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made from moments like this? On an occasion like this? Business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1 1. Leon Goretzka. Alfonso Davies. Goretzka. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? Eduardo Camavinga. Can he find the right pass? Now, disappointing end to the move. Joshua Kimmich. Gnabry with it. Pavard. Did well to win the ball back. Tony Kroos. Here's Valverde. And based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy, and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. Cross couldn't keep it. Jude Bellingham. And Bellingham... It needs an accurate cross. Not quite the accuracy he was looking for. That'll be a goal kick. Goretzka. Given away by Bayern Munich. Opportunity. Oh, it's a goal. A celebratory moment as they jump in front. Well, here's the replay. And just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. the match back in business Real Madrid with the advantage this might have potential and how well the keeper did well that's just exceptional he reacted so quickly there and the short option preferred is the chance on here 
But he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Cross played over, but no one can latch on to the ball. Promising sequence, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And Bayern, the recipients of the free kick here. Well, he'll be thanking his lucky stars that the referee settled for a verbal warning rather than a booking. Well, not one, Stuart, that's going to live long in the memory. Well, I think the manager might disagree, Derek. Any way you cut it, it's a wasted opportunity. Well, Bayern are certainly having an off day here. Their lack of creativity is a real worry. I'm just not sure how they get back into this one. Tony Kors. And now Rodrigo. Oh, surely! Chance, maybe. Real defensive resilience. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. And he's got the beating of his opponent. Vinicius couldn't quite hang on. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely. Well, here we can see it again. Normally, I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save. I'm not sure he could have done much more. Just a bit unfortunate, really, that it dropped to an opponent. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Serge Gnabry. Promising move this from Bayern. A really effective shielding under pressure. The ball back with Real now. Coman. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. The corner from Kimmich. And it crossed the byline, a goal kick as a result. Well, I must say, Vinicius Junior really giving an excellent account of himself. He's been very hard to play against. Well, he scored good goals, but his all-round play has been excellent. He looks like scoring every time he gets on the ball. So the whistle then, we're up the halfway stage in this match. Into the second half then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Real might threaten on the flank. Modric, and it might be really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, not the best clearance.
And in the end, no damage done. De Ligt. This is Coman. Well, he's given us away. Plenty of support here. Rodrigo. Musiala. On to Goretzka. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Well, not every keeper would have been that brave. Well, he read it brilliantly, didn't he? Top stuff from the keeper. Jamal Musiala. Excellent ball over the top. Gnabry. Textbook defending inside the box. And the goalkeeper will claim it. Well, as you can see, Real Madrid have controlled the possession. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Well, the supporters think it's on. And a goal to increase their advantage to three. Can they be stopped? Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. So on they go again, and every indication that Real are going to stroll to victory here. Serge Gnabry. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Can they take advantage of the situation? And a goal here! There it is! They've done it! Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. And he's won the ball. Teammates available. But quick thinking defensively. Leon Goretzka. And offside, unfortunately. And Bayern will change personnel now. And he read it well. Sané. Muller. Body in the way. He's got space. And a decent delivery. Able to deal with the threat. Vinicius Jr. And on to Bellingham. Corner given to Real Madrid. Keen to take it short here. Opportunity maybe. Excellent block. A foul, but advantage Bayern. Vinicius Jr. Vinicius! 
Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Thomas Müller. This is Coman. It will be a Bayern corner. Favouring the short one. What's he going to do here? Müller. And the danger's still on. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. Just ten minutes to go. Vinicius Junior. And can they create something? Now the attack fizzled out. Flag up, tight offside. It's a substitution for Bayern. Well, close to the end of this contest, and Real Madrid absolutely cruising. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile. And a goal to delight the fans! Just what they were hoping for! Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Vinicius Junior. Great opportunity. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. On a time for composure on the ball. Jamal Musiala. Well, the electronic board showing three additional minutes. Continues his run, but nothing comes of it. Musiala. Oh, the threat is there. And fine goalkeeping. Can he put it away? And there it is! Real Madrid, Champions League winners! Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Real Madrid. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it 
with your own supporters. Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.